for you. Step on it. There you are. Let's hurry. I should be able to form a path to the center. The Spawn Stream. To think of the dwarves who built this device and all that they knew. There it is. I've never been this close. Sad that we must put it to rest. This will take a few moments and all of my focus. Sentinels! They won't stop until I halt the stone stream. Keep them back! More sentinels, just like the ones in the chapter house. It's like... trying to hold back a river! I'm trying! Draw their lot from the stone stream. All we can do is hold them back. It's beginning to stop. Just a little while longer. We must buy Phineas time. Press the attack. I need to rest a while. Go on, quickly. I'll be safe here. Phineas did it, didn't he? The fans have stopped, which means that the well is going to be a dangerous place very soon. Unfortunately, it won't be soon enough. Jane's army broke through and her men are storming into the bedrock. Lord Devonsey and his soldiers are holding them off. Help them buy us some time to get our explosives ready. Then we'll send those bastards to Azanai.
are fighting below. Maybe fight for Queen Rosalind. Without you, we would have been overrun. Queen Rosalind owes you a great debt. safe. Look, down there. We held the high ground, but they're pushing us back. My soldiers need your help. You can take the floating platform to the bottom. Thanks to you, we still have our cannons from the swamp. We'll use them to cover you until Roderick signals us all to retreat. Do whatever you can to delay Jane's army. We need more time for the vapors to build up at the bottom of the well. Not enough to burn. Not yet. Jane Cassandra calls Parley. Lower your weapons. We've come here to talk. I would know who leads my enemy's army. Tell me, why is your face so familiar? Are you the child of some lord that I've slain? My father was Hugh Montbarrow, Grand Master of the Legion. You murdered him in the Mournweald. And the girl? The one who stands with you? Why does an Archon fight against her own kind? Be silent, traitor. You and your handmaids are no blood of mine. My lady, I know them. These are the Legionnaires who spared my life in Raven's Rill. Mercy from the Legion? I find that hard to believe. Unless it was some kind of ploy. Violence has always been the Legion's way. Ever since Hugh Montbaron murdered the old king. Did you plan the same for little Queen Mouse? What did we do to earn your hate? It couldn't have been the death of some distant king. Some distant king? Yes. He must seem so to you. The old king. The man your legion sought to murder and displace. He was my father. And your mother? Who was she? An Archon. One of the last of her kind. Granted shelter and solace by my father, the King. If your father was the old King, then you and Rosalind are family. By blood, Rosalind is my niece. But I will never call her kin. Her family stood by, content to watch, while I destroyed the Legion and avenged our father. Only then did they turn against me. They raised an army to put me in chains. A mistake. They'd tell you. If they were not all dead. If the royal family turned against you, they must have had good reason. Good reason? Only if you count jealousy and fear. People had begun to whisper that the king had been my father. They were rumors, nothing more. But they worried the rightful heirs. I had no designs upon the throne. Not then. But neither would I go quietly to the noose. They created the very monster they feared. Rosalind had no part in any of this, so why fight her? Because Rosalind is weak. She could never rebuild this nation alone. She'll be forced to rely upon others, like your legion. And you will have power over her. But that is what you want, is it not? I have no need to make such bargains. I am strong enough to rebuild my father's kingdom on my own. 
And greater powers, not of this world, have shown their favor of me. I will not fail. Roslyn said nothing of this to me. Does she know that she's your niece? Perhaps she doesn't know. If her family kept it from her, what better way to let a shameful secret die? We've spoken enough about your father and his kin. Now you know why I lay claim to this kingdom. I am well within my rights. You say your mother was an Archon? A creature out of myth? She came to this world with her sisters, seeking the last gods they once served. Look no farther than the woman who fights at your side, if you don't trust my words. She is one of my mother's kind, whether she knows it or not. What if I take you at your word? Can we negotiate a truce? They need not be killed, my lady. We could offer exile, or... Not to the Legion. No. I have heard the voices of my mother's lost gods. On this day, they will grant me victory over you and the Pretender Queen. This parley is finished. Remain here, and you will be slain. Try to run, and I will hunt you down. We shall not speak again. Something is coming. Something very large. <laughs>